right in our backyard. It's the yeah. learning, you know? Really cool stuff. Also really cool to wake up to sunshine, yeah. great temperatures, and it looks like we might have a good weekend ahead too. Laura, I told you on Monday that you this did. weekend, because you know your birthday That's was right. earlier this week, that you could still get out and celebrate this weekend. I think if anyone wants to celebrate, maybe it's just simply the forecast, you can get out and do just that. No huge concerns. And today has been rather refreshing. I know a lot of you are still cleaning up, so we all feel for you from 3 News here. But we're about 5 to 10 degrees cooler than this time yesterday, so that puts everyone widespread in the 70s. The coolest location right now is 72 degrees at the Cuyahoga County Airport in contrast to that. The Akron Canton area are a little closer to 80 degrees, but nonetheless, that's actually unseasonably cool for this time of the year. Our average high temperatures are usually found in the mid 80s. The dew points also dropped a little bit. It's not as refreshing as it could be, but it's definitely not what it was yesterday. You noticed the humidity when you stepped out the door and knew something was going to happen yesterday just because we had those ingredients in the atmosphere and Betsy and Jason told you all the latest yesterday with the event that did unfold and it was caused by the same cold front that's just making its way through the Carolinas and then up the eastern seaboard too. the New England area continues to deal with ongoing rainfall thanks to that area low spinning about and then we have this stationary front too. so folks a little bit closer to St. Louis and points a little bit further to the south. They've got some pretty decent wet weather that they're going through this evening tied to a stationary boundary. That means things aren't moving a whole lot. They're stationary. That's where the name comes from. But we've got a beautiful evening, whether that's outdoor dining plans you have. Maybe it's just tidying up the front yard and backyard from the wind we had yesterday. You can do that again. No huge concerns when it comes to the forecast today, tomorrow and really as we go through the entirety of the weekend. Temperatures though will fall from the mid 70s back into the upper 60s as we go through the evening. Mainly clear conditions. So if you love to stargaze tonight's going to be fantastic for you. And if you love outdoor exercise tomorrow is fantastic for you too. No alerts to speak about. You're good from morning through the evening through the afternoon. Whenever you want to get out, you can do so. So in your national segment on the hour forecast for the day tomorrow. We do start the day in the 60s, so still cool but comfortable. We build back near 80 degrees and we are going to have plentiful sunshine across Northeast Ohio. So if you do have plans, maybe it's the pool with the kiddos, the grandkids, whomever you want to take. Maybe it's just yourself. The forecast is swimmingly perfect across the area. Just make sure you've got the sunscreen and you've got the sunglasses too, because 80 degrees doesn't stay 80 degrees as we approach. Even someday things will get a little bit warmer, but I did mention in my tease earlier to you that the climate prediction center actually gives outlooks for the next six to 10 and then eight to 14 days and the next six to 10 days for the majority of the country. This is not just the Midwest. This is not just an Ohio thing. We are all going to start to trend above average. And if you remember, we've only had one 90 degree day at Cleveland Hopkins. We are set to maybe approach 90, if not hit 90 several times as we go through the end of this upcoming week. It does come in tandem with a few isolated rain chances as it looks right now. Now we'll keep you posted if things evolve and change, of course, but near Union Home Mortgage Extended Forecast this weekend is awesome. Please make yourself uh, uh, some outdoor plans. Maybe it's for the day tomorrow. Maybe it's for Sunday. Maybe it's for both days. Tea times sound fantastic too. I think I might take myself to the driving range as I continue to learn a little bit more about golf. But we have isolated rain chances as we go through Monday and Tuesday. Wednesday looks closer to 90 degrees. Things do get toasty and we will eventually get a little bit closer to that 90 degree mark by Thursday, especially. So uh, Laura, I told you this weekend would be great. Do you have any plans made? Uh, pool. Maybe, maybe I'll go to the driving range. There's a okay. lot to do here in Northeast I can, Ohio. I can bring you with. Yeah, right. let's go together. Yes, um, perfect. It's time, right? Perfect weekend, oh, 10 yeah. out of 10. Beautiful, beautiful. All leading up to that 90 degree day. Mm -hmm. And you were right on Monday. Let, let the record be clear. I know. So, we, Peyton, we thank do you. Good things here. <laughs> yes, mm -hmm. you do. Thank you. <laughs>